This is the HP Sprocket 2-in-1. It is able to print 2 by 3 inch photos from your smartphone printer and the instant camera. Let's do the unboxing and see what this printer is all about. First, let's remove the 2-in-1 from the box. So this is a camera and it is also a printer so it has got this sprocket 2 in 1 setup card where we need to download the HP sprocket apps from the Apple store or the Google Play store this is an instruction on how to load the Zing photo paper this is to charge the sprocket and in order to use a camera, you need to pop up the viewfinder. So this is the Zing photo paper. It consists of uh, 10 sheets of uh, sticky back photo sheets. And over here, we have the regulatory and safety information as well as the warranty statement let's see what else do we have it also comes with the USB cable as well as a wrist strap or a wrist lanyard so this is what we have in box for the HP Sprocket 2-in-1 we are going to show you how to install the paper into the sprocket 2-in-1 peel off the plastic cover you notice that the cover will open so from the looks of this this is very much similar to a sprocket so this is a zinc photo paper let's open this up and do take note of the orientation for the paper itself so we need to load it with this zinc smart sheet facing downwards So once it's loaded, you can replace the cover. We are going to show you how to charge the Sprocket 2-in-1. You can either use a mobile phone charger that we have over here, or even a power bank. For this example, we will use the power bank to demonstrate how to charge the sprocket 2-in-1 so with the USB cable that come in box with the sprocket first plug one end of the USB into the power bank and then with the other end you need to plug it into the sprocket 2-in-1 as shown now when the sprocket is charging the LED will be red in color note that the charging time may be up to 120 minutes and it is able to print up to 35 prints We're going to show you how to download the HP Sprocket apps. First, you need to go to the Play Store. Under the Play Store, let's do a search for HP Sprocket.
So this is the HP Sprocket apps that we need to install. Tap on install. Once installed, you can open the apps. So this is the welcome screen and we can connect our sprocket printer. Let's turn on our sprocket to win one. This is the power button, you press and hold and it is power on. You will notice that there is a request for Bluetooth pairing. Tap OK to pair with HP Sprocket 2-in-1. Let us tap on Setup and select Sprocket 2-in-1. So we have loaded our paper, tap on Next. And we have also charged our sprocket 2-in-1. Go to next. Now, sprocket 2-in-1 has a printer as well as camera modes. For printer mode, we need to connect and print from the sprocket apps. For the camera mode, we open the viewfinder by gently pressing down on it. Go to next. We have paired with the Sprocket 2-in-1, so let's get connected. Tap on, let's go. We will allow the Sprocket to access this device location. And also to take pictures and record video. We will also allow Sprocket to access photos, media and files on our device. So we are all set now. Let's go to Gallery and tap on Sprocket. Select Printers. Select HP Sprocket 2-in-1. So this is the status of our HP Sprocket 2-in-1. Do note that the Sprocket 2-in-1 has a SD card slot where you can insert the micro SD. In this case, there is none installed. We'll show you in a while how to install the micro SD into the Sprocket 2-in-1. So now we have our apps that is HP Sprocket and it is also connected to our Sprocket 2-in-1. The Sprocket 2-in-1 does not come with any micro SD card but it has got a micro SD card slot as shown over here. So you can actually purchase your micro SD card separately and use it for this camera. So we're going to show you how to insert the micro SD card. What we have here is a micro SD card. It's a 4 gig card. Do note that you will need to format it to the format as a FAT32 format. So insert the SD card into the 2-in-1 as shown. Push it in and it should be clicking in place. So now whatever photos you take will be saved to the SD card. So I'll just turn on the instant camera as the viewfinder is up and you can take a photo. Once you take a photo and if there's paper in the sprocket, it will print instantly. The HP Sprocket 2-in-1 is now printing a photo that we have just taken using the instant camera. You will first print the calibration sheet, followed by the 
photo that we have just printed. So this is the photo that we have just taken using the camera. And you can see that the red LED is blinking because there's no more paper in the sprocket 2-in-1. As shown over here.